we're looking for resources on being more accurate and working not to miss details. So, so here's what I came up with. I basically came up with three different things that I think we need to have, three different skills, if you will. So the first skill is that we need to know essentially the process for achieving an accurate outcome. We need to know what accuracy actually looks like in any given situation and the steps that we go through to achieve accuracy. That's number one. We have to know that um, in order to actually create an accurate outcome. If we're guessing, if we're trying to figure something out as we go, then chances are pretty good that our outcome at first is not going to be accurate. And we're going to have to develop our understanding over time to come to an accurate outcome. I hope this is making sense. Step number one, understanding the process for how to get to an accurate outcome. Number two would be to implement that process slowly and with an engaged mind. I think that we have to slow down and really tune in to our work in order to catch details, in order to actually produce accuracy. We can't be multitasking. We can't have distractions all around us. That just enhances the chances of error and, and missing important details. It's one of the reasons why a lot of people now working from home are like, oh, I'm getting so much done and my work is so much better because they're able to focus a little bit more. So that would be step number two, is to slow down and engage with the work so you can really focus on it. And then the third thing that I came up with is basically having a system in place to double check your work, right? So, so having someone or something that helps to, to make sure that you've implemented the correct process and achieved the accurate outcome. So let me go through those three steps again, and then I see there's some chat going on and I wanna find out what you guys think about this. My steps as I've defined them. Step number one is that you have to understand the process for how to achieve an accurate outcome. So if we're going to use an example here, um, you know, proofreading, you have to understand grammar, you have to understand correct spelling, you have to understand the fundamentals of the language in order to do it correctly, right? So step number one is to understand the process for achieving an accurate outcome. Number two is to slow down and focus on what you're doing, stay engaged. And step number three is to have a system in place to double check your work, either with another person or that you have a system in place for double checking your work. Mm -hmm.